Good evening YouTube, brewed by me, back again, I'm doing another review tonight, yes I am. Tonight I'm going to be reviewing a beer from the Mill Street Brewery. This is their Cobblestone Stout, it just came out. Um, supposedly it has the good hypes, um, it's well liked. Um, everybody that I've uh, heard or seen enjoy it. Um, Unfortunately, uh, they did a little YouTube video, Mill Street anyways, and the head brewmaster said that you should serve it cold. Why is that? I'm not 100% sure. Um, but I usually thought that stouts are better at room temperature, but that's just my opinion. Anyways, so Cobblestone Stout. This is 4.2% ABV. Our nitrogen charged dry stout is an exercise in smooth with deep roasted smoky palette and a crisp lingering hop note on the finish. This is a stout lover stout, traditionally low in alcohol and calories. This classic pub ale is a gift from our breweries to you. So Mill Street Cobblestone Stout Draft. Using my Mill Street tulip glass. Let's open her up and uh, see what we get. So the nitrogen is exposed. We should get a nice backwards waterfall kind of I don't know if you guys can see it the nitrogen is pushing up and the oxygen is pushing down so it's creating that kind of uh, there's a finger ahead it's a nice uh, tanny brown head um, it is black I can't see through it even down here there is no red uh, coloring and uh, looks like there's some nice carbonation in there. So let's give her a smell and see what we think. Oh, it smells good. Mm, it smells good in the can. Hmm. Okay. Right off the nose, I'm getting a lot of chocolate and coffee. Mostly baker, uh, bitter baker's chocolate, like dark baker's chocolate. Followed by a slight bit of espresso uh, coffee. Kind of a earthy kind of bitterness. It smells good. It looks good. Let's give her a taste. It looks really creamy. good it is good people so initially the thing that the thing that gets you right off the bat is you take a swig of it it's so smooth so creamy very very soft in the mouth wow soft, creamy, smooth. The only thing the only thing I find is it's a little light in the body for a stout. It, maybe it's because of the um, the nitrogen and the smoothness of it but it feels light for a stout. Um, but other than that it's very very uh, smooth. So I take a swig of it, and the flavors you get right off the bat is a nice a slight bit of baker's chocolate, followed by a little bit of coffee, and then followed by some roasted barley and, and some, um, maybe a slight bit of molasses, you know, dark, rich uh, flavors. very very light though it's so light that it almost tastes like well 
there's nice flavors there, but I don't know. It's it's the body of it is so light. Excuse me. Anyways, um, at the very back of the swig, there's a very very faint bit of bitterness. It's almost not even not existent, and it's kind of like a earthy woody kind of bitterness. But mostly the bitterness you're getting is that baker's chocolate. But all in all, it's a pretty good stout, cobblestone stout draft. Um, I was doing some uh, research and. Uh, from the people that have reviewed it or have had it both in the can and on draft, they say it's much better on draft. So, maybe that's the case, maybe not. Um, so, there's not much more I can tell you about this beer. There is a nice lot of those stout flavor characteristics when you're looking for in a stout. Um, very smooth, very creamy, a very, very light um, tasting. Um, you're picking up. You're picking up some of the. Uh, it's probably uh, your 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 standard uh, basic um, plain Jane Canadian two row um, with some um, probably some black pat malt, some chocolate malt, and maybe a little bit of roasted barley. Um, and your hops. I'm going to say Willamette or Mount Hood, um, something like that. Um, but it is a good stout. It's not fantastic by any means, but it's not bad. Um, like I said, the only thing that I'm not liking about it is the body of it is very, very light. And for me, stouts are supposed to be a little bit heavier, but it is what it is, and it is drinkable, it is good, so go find it if you can get it. It just came out uh, maybe two weeks ago, um, so... Give it a whirl, see what you think, let me know what you think. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please rate, comment, subscribe, leave any suggestions or ideas in the comments box, and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks for watching. Bye.